Happiness and regret afflict the potential owner of a beetle, because besides the few restored or original gems on our streets, there are still the rickety everyday beetles. It's because the car is mainly used as an everyday get-around car by students and people who just want to drive to work. They don't take care of them and they lose a lot of value. Our object of desire is a 1303 LS from 1973, one of the private cars of Gerhard Oettinger, a Beetle tuner from the very beginning. If the test drive was satisfactory, then you should scrupulously check the bodywork for rust, because it's the quality of the body that decides whether or not to buy the car. Does the car give an overall good impression? A good sign is the chrome parts. Problem zone for all beetles are the screw edges on the wing and the freestanding seam on the A pillar. The entire length of the door sill is extremely susceptible to rust both outside and inside. The rear side parts bounce around where the running board and the rear fender meet. The rust check continues up front. One feature of the model range is the McPherson front suspension. The strut requires a more exacting check. Take the spare tire out because water often collects under the spare when the boot seals no longer fulfill their obligations and the drain hole is clogged up with underbody sealant. Good for the person who has a car hoist at their disposal to check because hidden cases of rust are lurking under the beetle. The T-shaped front framed head is prone to shaking, a safety risk. Switching this out is only for professionals and isn't normally cost effective. A further look should be given to the floor halves, especially in the area where the chassis and car body are bolted together. Sheets are often welded together here overlapping. The battery is located behind the back seat to the right. Acid that has leaked accelerates rust pitting. If the plate is hidden under a thick layer of underbody sealant, it's best to tap it with a hammer. Beetle technology is uncomplicated and easy to repair. A light oil mist in the engine and gearbox isn't worrying. However, the heat exchanger and exhaust are very much in danger of rust and let exhaust fumes into the passenger compartment. Finding spare parts for the 03 series is also a sure thing. VW dealerships still have the working parts in stock. It's normal to find things like timers, spark plugs, of course, and fan belts. And if it's special parts that you need, you can buy them from us or from specialist dealers who have specialized in VW parts. Beetles have always been modified, refined, and made faster, just like this example, kitted out with a 2-liter Oettinger engine. If you're interested in this type of beetle, the alterations have to be recorded in the car documentation. Otherwise, you'll be on the road illegally and without valid insurance protection. If the beetle is original and more than 30 years old, it has the right to an H for historic at the end of the number plate. But be careful with modified beetles. The inspection authorities only accept newly refitted cars, which were there 30 years ago. You can get a 1303 hardtop in a good condition for 3,000 euros. Cars in top condition and special Beetle models can easily top the 8,000 euro mark. Modified pieces have to be valued individually. If the potential Beetle fan takes these purchasing tips to heart, their own Beetle won't end up so quickly in the graveyard.